What's the dumbest myth people today believe? You have to wait 48 hours to report someone missing. Had a cab driver insisting that the reactor meltdown at Fukushima was a failed Chinese attack on the US. The plan was to superheat the rods so they'd burn into the ground, through the center of the earth, and come out in America and irradiate it. Amazing. Anything about message. I battle with my health conscious wife about this often. Edit, too much of anything is bad for you. I still don't understand the demonization of message. That you eat spiders in your sleep. Spider will not knowingly walk into a predator's mouth. They can sense both the heartbeat, heat, and noise from humans. All things that would alert them not to go into our mouth had to explain to a grown ass adult that blood isn't blue inside the body and red once it hits oxygen because, blood already carries oxygen. EDA, I didn't expect this to take off, I first commented when the post was brand new and only had 30 comments. I understand that I came off as a snarky asshole about it, but the dude and I were cool after 10 minutes of convincing him that what he was taught was a myth. No hurt feelings, buds. I still believe that if any of my limbs hang off the bed while sleeping that a monster will grab them. I also believe that the moment I remember this and pull them back on the bed is just in the nick of time before a monster grabs them. You can't prove there isn't a monster under my bed. Lie detectors as a literal thing. There's a reason they aren't admissible as evidence in court in most places. It is believed in Indian culture that keeping your unibrow means good luck I kept my unibrow for 20 years thinking it is my good luck until I got stage 5th of kidney failure and I did my eyebrows after that because who gives a fuck about luck anymore. Now my eyebrows look cute AF. That humans only use 10% of their brain. This is false, regardless of how those who proclaim this myth seemingly demonstrate that it is in fact true. My dad had this guy helping him out, think big box store DIY curb ready helper, who told him if you sleep with your hair wet, you will bleed out of your mouth, and he was 110% sure that was fact. We were both just confused and bewildered at this statement. What the hell had this guy witnessed? Black belts have to register their fists as weapons. I can't believe I was dumb enough to fall for that. That Einstein failed his grade school math class. It was the subject of a Ripley's Believe It or Not column in 1935 and Einstein himself refuted the article. In primary school he had been at the top of class and by 15 he had mastered differential and integral calculus. That there are magic pills that make you lose weight and gain muscle without ever going to a gym. Or that there are snake oils that will take years off of your face and make you look young. There's a sucker born every minute. When I had cancer a few years back and was doing chemotherapy I had people who constantly questioned that I actually had cancer due to the fact that my hair didn't fall out until I was actually in remission, had been off chemo for about 2-3 to three weeks when my hair started gradually thinning and falling out. It's a complete myth that every single person's hair will have the same reaction to chemo. Some people lose hair right away, some don't. Everybody is different. There are dumber ones out there, but the one I, as an estate lawyer, deal with constantly is the idea that there needs to be a reading of the will, where the family all gather and the lawyer reads it aloud to them for the first time. We don't do that, we just mail everyone their own copy if they want it. It's a really stubbornly persistent one because people continue to see scenes of it in movies and TV shows, where it's used for some big dramatic reveal. I've even had irate beneficiaries insist that the administration of the estate can't be official until there's a reading. Way, way back, like 150 years ago or so, I believe we used to do something like that at times because you couldn't exactly presume literacy on the part of the beneficiaries, but now we feel it's a pretty safe bet that you can either read it or find someone who can. And Halloween candy is commonly laced with drugs or razor blades. Many people still believe hymens are like plastic food seals that cover up the hole and get popped when you have sex for the first time, and if a girl doesn't bleed she's not a virgin. 
still blows my mind that people think the earth is flat. I remember the myth that gum takes 7 years to fully pass through your digestive system. That magnetic jewelry slash healing will cure just about anything. A dude named Mesmer the 1780 came up with the idea, and it have been debunked many times, yet it's still a billion dollar industry. Fun fact, the word mesmerized is related to him.